So with the movie slash Bayverse characters, we will focus on, I will list it as studio series here, because they aren't based on Gen 1 and that's pretty much what everything were for Cybertron scale wise is based off of. But so let's start with Thundercracker. Thundercracker we technically do have a studio series figure for. It just does not feel right though. I mean, I have not had this mold. The mold seems fine. It just doesn't come across as Thundercracker to me. And so he originally had a figure with like Dark of the Moon, I think. Dark of the Moon or Revenge of the Fallen, where he was what he normally is, a, a direct recolor of Starscream. And I would like to kind of see this in a studio series. Because it makes more sense to me that they use the same jet mode. That's what they always do. But we also technically see a bunch of him in uh, Bumblebee. So I, I wouldn't be surprised if we see him in Bumblebee uh, style Seeker as well. Actually, I think that's more likely than ever seeing him in the, uh, I think it's an F-22 mode. Similarly, we have a fig- we had previously seen a Dark of the Moon figure of Skywarp as an F- as an F-22, I think it is. And I think that works fine. We, I, we don't have a studio series figure for him yet at all. And while, again, while I feel like this would be an interesting figure, I'm pretty sure we're just going to see if you look at the bottom right corner of this image, you can see a seeker that looks to have some purple markings on it. People are guessing that's supposed to be Skywarp. Uh, we're likely we're most we're more likely to get that anytime soon rather than the Earth mode F twenty two. Uh thrust. Thrust we have a studio series figure for. It's the Cybertronian mode and it's coloring is based off Armada. I have nothing against this one. That one. Um I would sort of like to see an Earth Mode version, and I feel like this isn't isn't a bad one, even though he's not exactly an F, even though he doesn't use the same jet mode as Starscream in the original three. But then again, technically all of the Coneheads have modifications to their jet form, which make them not look exactly like an F fifteen the original cartoon anyway. Um, Dirge here, I don't, I don't like his, his design with his old figure as much, would I still want to see him to fill out the collection of Seekers? Yes, but I wouldn't mind if they updated him into like, say, Say if they want the cone heads to be a separate, a separate vehicle, maybe update him into the same form as Thrust over here that we had just looked at, or they can do what they did with Ramjet. Ramjet, actually, they did something similar to what they did with Animated for Ramjet. They made him exactly look like Starscream. And I don't think it looks that bad. But I I definitely feel like we might see both Dirge and Ramjet get Cybertronian form figures. Maybe we'll see them get jet modes. I wonder if it will be like I guess I wonder if they'll make them all will be based off their old figures, if they might all make them based off one of their old figures. Preferably either do ram jets where they all stay the same jet, or they do uh, 
thrusts, and then they all have a separate jet than the original three trio of seekers, but they all share the same jet within the cone heads. But yeah.